Hey guys, hey girls, hey boys. So for today's video, I'm going to be doing a what's in my school backpack video. So I was wondering, like, I want to do some back to school ideas. I want to maybe do a haul, but I was like, why not just do like a what's in my backpack? Because I like hauls, but at the same time, I like to see how it's organized in bags. So that is what I'll be doing today. I am a very organized person, I believe. I'm just being honest. And I like to have all my stuff like in little bags and just so I know where everything's at. So when I'm in class, I'm not going to freak out and be like, where is this? Where's my pencil? Where's my notebook? Like, things like that. Before we start this video, if you are, let's see, if you are in college, give this video a thumbs up. I want to see who's in college because your girl is starting her sophomore year in college and I'm ready to just finish and graduate and get that degree. Who agrees? Okay, before we start this video, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and also turn on the little notification bell so you're notified every single time that I post. So without further ado, let's just get right into the video. Alright, so, oof. My backpack is heavy because of my laptop. So let me just show y'all. So this is my backpack. It's just a simple black backpack. I actually picked this up at... Marshalls or TJ Maxx. Um, I don't want to get something too expensive because it's gonna go on the floor It's just gonna get dirty. I don't want to bring something that's expensive because you know, I like to keep my expensive things precious and I don't want to get ruined at school. Okay, so yeah, my backpack is from one of those stores Marshalls, Northern Mac, whatever and it has like a different little compartments everywhere. It's actually um, compatible with the suitcase so in the back it has like heavy it has like this little thing right here so it could just slide onto my suitcase and I could just roll the suitcase so that is pretty handy if I want to bring it to the airport and on the sides it has little pockets for water bottles but to be honest I don't really put my water bottles on the side pockets I just like to carry them so that's that and in the front it has a little pocket here a pocket here and also this is pretty cool I would never do this because I always carry my phone it's a little compartment for your telephone your little cell phone your cellular device that's pretty cool if you want to keep something in there but personally I don't keep my phone out of my hand I gotta hold it because you know people be snatching things and I'm not okay with that okay so before I get into the backpack um, I just realized I forgot I have my keys right here if you are in college or just in general I highly recommend that you guys get mace because people are a little crazy nowadays and you need something to protect yourself and I think this mace is pretty handy you can just hang on your little keychain especially if you're in college like in a dorm or something you're walking places a lot I highly recommend something to keep yourself protected so this little mace right here is from Home Depot I think but they sell it at like Staples, Target, different kind of stores but I really recommend this pepper spray mace, whatever you want to call it. That is way too close to my face. Gotta throw that over there. Going straight into the backpack, I'm gonna open it up. It also has this little buckle thing so it keeps this together. So I'm gonna open it. So inside, it looks like this. In the back pocket, I have my laptop. So I'm gonna take that out because that's weighing it down. If you are in college, you are going to for sure need a laptop. Literally everything is going to be online for you. You can get textbooks online, you can use Chegg to help you out with your homework, Quizlet, even though Quizlet's, I think it's done. I don't know, I saw something on Twitter. But laptops are going to be your best friend when in school because most of the time your teacher is gonna sign things online, gonna send you stuff. You don't really get paper copies anymore, so highly recommend these Apple laptops. If you don't want an Apple laptop, go ahead and get your own girl, but I'm just saying I think Apple is like the best. You can even download like Google Chrome if you need that. And I think they're having a special where if you buy a laptop, you get free beats. So you better go over there and use your student discount because these are worth it. I love MacBooks. Next, I have notebooks. I have three different colors. I like to get different color notebooks because when it comes to the classes, I know like Say for instance, bio, oh, that's gonna be my blue one, English, my white one, just, I have, I like different colors. So here I have three of them. So I have a pink one, a white one, and a little teal one. Again, I just like to get different colors because I feel like it's easier for me to pick out which of my classes I'll need it for. And yeah, they're just like one subject notebooks, college ruled, of course, you don't want no wide ruled, come on, we're grown, we're grown. So these are from Target, and I have, this one's, this one's actually a Target brand. This one's five star. They work the same for me, so I highly suggest notebooks unless you want to get like a three subject. I was kind of thinking like I could have just got one big notebook, but you know, 
it's preference. So I got three different notebooks. I really love the colors. They're so cute. All right, so the next thing inside of my bag is a planner. I get a little crazy when it comes to planners. I see so many different cute planners. Like, I want to buy them all. Like, at this point right now, I have two different planners for this year. Maybe three. Yeah, I have three planners. In reality, I only need one. I tell myself, like, oh, this could be for this, this could be for that. Like, no, just get one planner, girl. So this planner says, do what you love. And I love it because it has pink writing. And I'm a big fan of pineapples. And that's what the background is. I actually picked this up from TJ Maxx. And the price is still back here. It's only $8, which is really good. Because inside, it's just so cute. Like, all the months are different colors. And then it has... All these like you know like your girl uses this planner she uses it okay in the back has some graphing paper to do's like rate your year different things I just love planners because I feel like it makes me feel like I'm getting my life together in reality like most of the times I'm not always writing on it though but I try to tell myself to write it because I'm like I remember things later that makes sense like and I look back like wow my life is together <laughs> And in the back, it also has a whole bunch of little stickers like vacation, holiday, birthday, lunch date, different little things. So yeah, I highly recommend a planner. It helps you stay organized, especially if you have a bad memory. So get yourself a planner. So next thing that I have is a portable charger. Again, I highly recommend things that are like portable like this and sometimes you don't always have an outlet that's near you. So. I learned in my first year of college that portables are very handy because sometimes the classes are huge, the phone, like the plugs are far, so I'm not gonna go leave my phone. Some people be doing that. I'm like, girl, how do you have this trust? So I love to have a portable charger with me because I never want a dead phone. You never know what could happen. I will like freak out if my phone is dead. So I have to make sure that I have this portable charger and this one is from the brand Mophie. I picked it up at Best Buy for I think $40, so it's not too bad and it has like uh, four little battery dots and it charges my phone to 100% like two times. It lasts me a very long time. I usually like just charge it overnight and it's like good for two days. So portable charger, best thing to do. Best thing to get, you need to get one. So next thing that I have are my glasses. I am pretty, pretty blind. Um, when it comes to classes, like teachers will be doing things on the overhead or the whatever it's called projector and my eyesight is bad so your girl gotta bring her glasses with her I'm trying to get contacts but you know I'm lagging I gotta go and I'm also scared because I don't know how to do contacts I feel like it's just gonna irritate my eyes I hear so many different stories let me know in the comments down below if you wear contacts and how you feel about them because I'm kind of like over glasses at this point plus when I have my makeup done I wear glasses it just ruins like the whole point of doing makeup so but you know, I have to see what's going on in class and I have to see what's happening when I'm driving. So I got my glasses right here. On the side right here, you guys are probably gonna think I'm crazy, but when it comes to writing notes in class, I have to be color coordinated. Like, I don't know, it just makes me like pay attention more. And if something's like one thing, when I go back to try to like remember what we learned or study whatever, I'll just be like, ugh, like if it's just one color. So I have to color coordinate. And when you open up my bag, it looks like this. So I have all my different color pens and a pencil right here. Again, I just love like bright colors and I love writing with colors. I don't know. It just helps me stay, um, what's the word? Like, I don't lose focus, I guess, or I don't get like bored. I don't know. And it's also fun, like I'm trying to, I mean, it's hard though because if they're going fast, I'm like switching between colors. People probably look like, girl, just freaking write with pencil. But I love color coordinating my notes, so. These are from Papermates, so yes, I love these little pens, and that's not it, that's not it. So, next I have this little pencil bag, I guess it's a pencil bag, but it's really a makeup bag from Benefit. Inside, I have more colored pens and pencils and stuff. These are like my go-to pens, these are my favorite, these are like the marker pens. I'm pretty sure all you guys know about these pens, like my teacher had these when I was in elementary, like grading our stuff, and I was like... Can I have one? And she thought I was crazy, but from that day, I've been loving these pens. So I literally, like every single year, I'll buy a new pack. I just love all the colors. Like I wanna get more, but I don't need more. So I will switch between those like gel pens and then these marker pens right here. They're my favorite. And of course, you gotta have some basic black pens. And I have some more lead pencils. You know, these are the go-to lead pencils. Like, girl, no one is borrowing my pencils. I'm telling you that. These are my go-to pencils. I love how it has the twisty eraser. And you can, little, you can just press this 
to take the lead out. These are my favorite lead pencils. I love them. I don't know if it's just me and my crazy that I have like certain pens and pencils that I like, but that's just how I am, okay? I don't know why I thought it was okay to film with a sweater. I'm literally sweating. Going into the front compartment, I don't think I have anything in here. No, nothing in there. I don't want to carry too much stuff with me because then it just gets really heavy. The laptop makes my backpack heavy enough, so that's just like, gotta keep it bare minimum. And in the front, what do I have? Oh yeah, okay, so in the front I keep some gum and I also keep some mints. So again, I'm in college, lectures get long and boring so if I'm bored I like to keep some fruity gum just to chew or I'll have a snack with me because I'll get hungry my stomach's gonna growl I need something to give this mouth some flavor and I also like to keep some mints because you never know if your mouth is just gonna get nasty and you just want that fresh breath you know so these are the Altai Altides Altoids Altoids um peppermints so I'm actually gonna take one right now so that's pretty much it and what I keep in my backpack. Just typical things, notebooks, planner, um, laptops, pencils, all that stuff, all the good stuff that you need. I try to keep it minimal because you don't want to carry too much with you at school. Um, of course, some days I'll bring some food because like I said, I'll get hungry maybe in class. And a water bottle for sure because it's a long day. You're going to get thirsty. You're not going to want to drink out of those fountains, so bring yourself a water bottle. And yeah, I feel like this video is really short, but that's pretty much all I bring to school with me. Like I just started school. This is the bag that I take and it's good enough for me. That's all I really need. Oh. Actually, pause. Okay, I forgot I recently went to Best Buy and I picked up these. So, you know, sometimes in class you have time to work or if you're going to the library or if you're walking through the campus, you want to have some type of music going on. So, it's been a while to purchase these, but finally I was like, I just need to do it. Like, school starting and not even just for school, even for the gym, they're helpful. So, I picked up the Apple AirPods and honestly, it's like the best thing that I did. They're super handy, super easy, they're not in the way. And I don't know, I just love them. Sometimes, like I said in class, especially in college, you can do what you want. So if you're getting a little bored and dozing off, just take an AirPod, put one ear, cover it, and you're good to go. So I highly recommend AirPods. Um, I don't know how it works with high school because I know teachers are strict with that. So maybe not in class, but when you're walking, I think you should be okay. But you guys, if you don't have some AirPods, I highly recommend you go and pick some up because they have been super handy for me. All right, so that's pretty much everything that I keep in my backpack. I just wanted to share with you guys on how like I organize my stuff. It's not too much, but it's just like the little things, like the way I keep my pencils in the little bags. I have my notebooks, color coordinated, planners, you know, everything. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. That is all for today's video. Um, I want to do some more back to school videos, so let me know in the comments down below on what you guys want to see. So let me know if you want to see like a back to school makeup tutorial. Also, just let me know what other types of back to school videos you guys want to see. Just leave them in the comments down below. I'll always be reading those. So that is all for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to give a thumbs up. Comment down below what you like to see in the future. Please subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe to my new Angel channel, which is MA Forever Ever. And also, when you subscribe, don't forget to hit that little notification bell so you're notified every single time that I post. Stay blooming, and I'll see you in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.